Hello, dear viewers. This is Tanvir Ahmad at Royal Academy of English. Subscribe my channel, Royal Academy of English, for new, interesting, and informative videos. Like these videos, share these videos, and press the bell icon. Dear viewers, today we are doing an English grammar lesson. In this lesson, you will learn about how to convert optative and exclamatory sentences from direct speech into indirect speech. So, let's start this very important lesson. Optative sentences. Look at this definition. These type of sentences express pray, desire, a wish. Look at this definition once again. These type of sentences express pray, desire, a wish. Rules While changing optative sentences from direct speech into indirect speech, we keep in mind the following instructions. Change the reporting verb into prayed or wished. Use wait. Further instructions. If in reported speech any noun or noun phrase is used to address someone or something, then it will be made the object of a reporting verb. Look at this statement once again. If in Reported speech, any noun or noun phrase is used to address someone or something, then it will be made the object of a reporting verb. Also, if reported verb consists the word sir, then after the converted reporting speech, word respectfully will be added. Look at this statement once again. If reported verb consists the word sir, then after the converted reporting speech, word respectfully will be added. Also, if reported speech begins with the word farewell, then the reporting speech will be changed into bad farewell. Examples Look at this sentence. He said, may you live long. This sentence expresses pray so. He prayed that I might live longer. In drug speech, also, he said to me, may you win scholarship. This sentence also expresses pray so he prayed that i might win scholarship in direct speech also he said to the teacher i'm not at fault sir he said to the teacher i'm 
not at fault, sir. In this sentence, there is a word, sir. So, while changing this type of sentence from direct speech into indirect speech, we add the word respectfully. He told the teacher respectfully that he was not at fault in direct speech. Also, he said to the principal, I was ill, sir. Direct speech. He told the principal respectfully that he was ill. In direct speech. Also, he said to her, May your brother get through the examination. This sentence expresses wish or desire. So, he wished that her brother might get through the examination. Indirect speech. Indirect speech. Also, he said, may you prosper. In this sentence, there is a presence of pray. So, he prayed that I might prosper in direct speech. Also, if reported speech begins with the phrases good morning, good evening, good night, good day, then the reporting speed will be changed into bad good morning, bad good evening, bad good night, bad good day. We can also put wished in place of bad. Look at this sentence. He said, Farewell, my friends. Direct speech. He bade farewell to his friends. In direct speech. Also, John said to his brother, Good morning, my brother. Direct speech. John bade good morning to his brother. Indirect speech. Also, Shilpa said to her uncle, Good evening, my uncle. Direct speech. Shilpa bade good evening to his uncle. Indirect speech. Also, Faisal said to his brother, Good night, my brother. Direct speech. Faisal bade good night to his brother. Indirect speech. Also, Alice said to his sister, Have a good day, my sister. Direct speech. Alice wished good day to his sister. Indirect speech. Exclamatory sentences. Look at this definition. A sentence that expresses strong feeling is called exclamatory sentence. Look at this definition once again. A sentence that expresses strong feeling is called exclamatory sentence. Rules. If sentence expresses happiness or joy, then its 
reporting verb will be chained, enter, exclaimed with joy, or exclaimed joyfully. Look at this statement once again. If sentence expresses happiness a uh, joy then its reporting verb then its reporting verb will be changed into exclaimed with joy a uh, exclaimed joyfully also if sentence expresses feelings a uh, sadness then Reporting verb will be changed, enter, exclaimed with sorrow, or exclaimed sorrowfully. After it, use they. Also, words which express sadness, happiness, or joy. I.e. Aha, Au, Alas, Hurrah, will be removed. Examples Look at this sentence. He said how high the mountain is. Direct speech He exclaimed that it was a very high mountain. Indirect speech. Also, she said, what a lovely flower it is. Direct speech. She exclaimed that it was a very lovely flower. Indirect speech. Also, they said, alas, we have lost the match. Direct speech. They exclaimed sorrowfully that they had lost the match. In direct speech. She said, Alas, my son has failed. This sentence expresses sadness so she exclaimed sorrowfully that her son had failed also kamran said hurrah i have got the first prize this sentence expresses happiness so kamran exclaimed with joy that he had got the first prize. Also, he said, Aha, I have won the prize. This sentence also expresses happiness. So, he exclaimed joyfully that he had won the prize. In direct speech. So, that is the end of the lesson. I hope you have found this lesson very useful. Subscribe my channel, Royal Academy of English, for new, interesting, and very, very important lessons. Other topics of interest of Royal Academy of English are Direct and indirect speech, part one. Direct and indirect speech, part three. Prepositions of place. Rules of spelling of English. Uses of definite article and indefinite articles and i also hope that you will also find these lessons very very useful okay thank you and goodbye keep watching your own channel
Royal Academy of English.